Hello guys, Keeper on TV here, back for yet another video. So, I've done a review on the Spurs game, of course it finished 1-0. I'm going to be doing another video, um, breaking down the game and, yeah, the key players and moments and uh, so on and so forth. So, first of all, our goalkeeper, our new goalkeeper, um, he did alright to be honest. He did alright. He was calm on the ball, he didn't hesitate. When he was getting pressed by the striker as well, um, there was one moment where he had to, yeah, rush his clearance because the striker was getting too close to him. Um, but he wasn't really tested. Um, what I do like about this new goalkeeper is though that he seems very calm on the ball. I mean, when a cross comes in, he seems to judge it well, and uh, he, when a when a cross comes in. Um, you know he punches it clear, so he doesn't like put he doesn't punch it into the danger area, which Lee Camp did sometimes. So he seems like a good goalkeeper judging on the performance against Spurs. So yeah, uh, first of all the goalkeeper. Second of all, our our new signing George Friend. He played as a left sided centre back today, and um, done absolutely tremendously. Absolutely tremendously. He was just solid as a rock. No one could get past him. He was always in the right place at the right time. And that that part when he mugged off Lucas Moura, that was funny, that was. Um, and he, yeah, so when I've, him as well, I mean, he was as calm and collective. When the pressure was on, he was putting blocks in the way. Um... He was getting his body in the way, sorry, not blocks in the way. But yeah, um, I think he can be a really good player. Um, I don't think Crank should play him as a left-back. I think he should be playing as a centre-back. Um, what my two centre-backs would be is um, George Friend, left side of centre-back, and Mark Roberts as our other centre-back for the game against Brentford. That's if we don't bring in another centre-back before that game. So yeah, um, George Friend, number two. Number three... The uh, youngsters, so the likes of George, um, Charlie Lakin, um, of course Odin Bailey come onto the pitch, um, Reed as well, but Charlie Lakin, he's going to have a mention in this game, played absolutely brilliantly, tracking back as well, showed some skills in the game, he seems like a different player this pre-season. Really does seem like a different player. Is he going to be breaking into that first team? Well, by the looks of it, that's what he wants to do. That's his ambition. Um, of course, he was on loan at Stevenage last season. And he wants to prove a point to Karenka that he can, uh, what he can deliver in the first team. So, um, yeah, George up front, though. Not really impressed with him, to be honest. Um, his decision making was poor. Um, kept losing the ball. Something that he definitely needs to work on. I know he's a young player, and he's got time to improve. But um, yeah, he was pretty poor today, and it, we desperately need a striker, don't we? Jukovic, I don't know how long he's going to be out for. Hopefully, he's back for the Brentford game in two weeks' time. Um, so yeah. Fifth or fourth or fifth, I don't know. But um, the final, you know, final talking points of Bella and Crowley. They played absolutely brilliantly today, especially Crowley. You know, the quick feet he was showing. Um, yeah, he was just a breath of fresh air to watch, to be honest. I say a breath of fresh air, but it's his second season at the club. And you can just tell, can't you, that Karanka already has made us better. Has made us better in one or two games. Because we looked much better defensively, much more compact. Spurs found it really hard to break us down. Um, and, you know, it was pass our passing was good today. You can just tell that Karanka... It's going to build something special at St Andrews. Prepare to get excited, lads, because 
I think this season is going to be a good one. Um, judging by that performance, we can definitely build on that. Bring in a couple of more players and I think we'll be on our way and ready for the new season. Uh, there's no way I can see us being in a relegation battle. But anyway guys, thanks for watching. Make sure to like, share and also subscribe. Keep on TV, keep on. See you later.